friends, uh, the timekeeper has been at me, so I'm going to be brief and quick. First up, friends, welcome to the 10th annual Knowledge Summit of IFA Galaxy. Can we all have a round of applause to all ourselves for doing this for the 10th occasion? 10 years of learning, 10 years of togetherness, and 10 years of hope. I'm sure you'll all agree that the last 10 years has been as exciting as it has been adventurous, right? I'm reminded of a quote, we're all able to see far because we stand on the shoulders of our fathers. It's a very famous quote. So IFA Galaxy has transferred over the last 10 years and it's, we are here among the 10th event thanks to the wonderful work that's been done by the leaders of IFA Galaxy so far. So I want to take a minute to recognize each of those leaders. And as I call out their name, I would request them to please stand up wherever they are and get recognized. First up, Ramesh Bhatt, the first president of IFA Galaxy. <laughs> Ramesh no, needs no introduction. He has set the trailblaze. Thank you, Ramesh. The first secretary, Mr. Srinivasan, who is in the MC desk. Thank you, Srini. The second president who took it off from Ramesh and drew it to the next height, Mr. A.K. Narayanan. Thank you, sir. The second secretary and the third president, Mr. V.K. Sudarshan, who then drew it to further heights. And my dear friend Venkat, who was the secretary in, with V.K.S. Friends, all these people have set the course for why we are all here and celebrating the 10th occasion. But to give you the truth, these six people or me and my secretary are the people you see up front, but there is a large team. Such an event cannot be done but for a very large team. So I have an executive committee comprised of seven eminent people and you will know them during the course of this event. And about 30 odd people in the subcommittee who have been my hands, legs, shoulders, and mind right through these four months while we have planned this whole event. So can I request you to give a big round of applause to all those volunteers of the subcommittee who have made this event possible. I want to take two minutes to talk about the theme of this event. Every time we celebrate an important milestone, a 10th year is an important milestone in the life of any institution, no less for a body of a knowledge body like IFA Galaxy. And while we were discussing and my committee were putting through thoughts, one of the things that became very clear to us is, while we celebrate 10 years of our existence as a, as a body and as this annual summit, it's extremely important to look ahead the next 10 years because we believe that the change that has been unleashed in the last 10 years will continue to drive this industry in the next 10 years as well. So the theme of this event is the next decade. And through this event today and tomorrow, what we want to leave back is that the next decade of big change that is going to come. And friends, any change or any challenge that we all look at has another side which is called an opportunity. Every challenge, if you look at the other side of that coin, is an opportunity. So we really want to look at what the challenges are but essentially look at the other side of the coin, which is the opportunity which can help all of us grow to the next level. So next decade is the theme of this, this whole conference, and I'm sure there will be important takeaways that all of us have. I want to spare just one minute, because I am amongst you as an IFA, and I recognize three simple things that I want to communicate to you today that is very important for all of us. You know, IFAs like doctors reach their peak pretty late in life. You don't start being great. Unlike software engineers, you don't make your be best money when you're young. You make it as you mature and you become older and you recognize, you get all those knowledge and experience. So three things I think is very important for all of us. I hope this conference will cover, but I just thought I should mention. One is health, friends. I hope you are in some form of health regime, yoga, workout, running, whatever be that. Please continue it in some form, because this is the only body we have in this lifetime, and it's extremely important we use it well so that we can further our career and our knowledge going forward. So health is a very important part. I want you to focus on that. 
an IFA's life is all about constant learning. We, we are an industry about knowledge. We share knowledge. That's what we, we are. And so constant learning is part and parcel of our life. So like doctors, financial doctors that we are, need to get into the habit of investing a certain portion of our time every day, every week, every year into knowledge enhancement. And a body like IFA Galaxy exists only to help you do that. So please spend some time for knowledge. And last is, of course, a sense of gratitude. I think we have lots to complain about. But believe me, we are possibly 1% of the population who has everything going for us. So spare a few minutes for gratitude, and I'm sure you'll have a great life ahead. I am not going to stand between you and the rest of the speakers who have a lot to share today. All I want you to do is sit back, but don't relax. Because two days, we have a lot coming to you, and I want you to take back and grow your practice to the next level. Last, before I leave, I want to give a small message. The volunteers have done enormous work in putting this event together. If there are a few shortcomings, please do bear with them. If you have anything credit to give, please give it to the volunteers. If you have shortcomings, please come to me, and I will try and help you. Thank you so much. Have a lovely day of learning today and tomorrow. Thank you.